what's the role of randomness in Bohmian mechanics? Standard quantum mechanics is a probabilistic theory and Bohmian mechanics a deterministic one, right? So how does randomness come about in Bohmian mechanics? The role of randomness in Bohmian mechanics is essentially the same as the role of randomness in classical statistical mechanics, as understood by Boltzmann. The microscopic dynamics is a deterministic one. Limited access to microscopic initial conditions requires a coarse-grained description of physical systems. The coarse-grained description must emerge naturally from the underlying microscopic dynamics and has to tell us what typically happens in the physical world. That means what happens for the overwhelming majority of initial conditions in a given situation. Thus we need some measure of typicality on the space of microscopic description, the space of initial conditions. In order to understand which sets of microstates are large and which are not. The proper measure of typicality must be singled out by the underlying dynamics. It must be guaranteed that typicality is preserved under the dynamics. What is typical today must be typical tomorrow. In classical statistical mechanics this is realized by a stationary measure on phase space, one which is independent of time, like the microcanonical measure, or the canonical measure for a subsystem. In Bohmian mechanics, due to the general time dependence of the wave function, this is realized by a so-called equivariant measure on configuration space, namely psi square. This is the measure naturally given by the Bohmian dynamics, such that if we evolve it along the Bohmian trajectories, then at a later time t, the measure will simply be psi square of t. This measure can directly be read off from the continuity equation of quantum mechanics. Since the current therein is the Bohmian current, the corresponding density, namely psi square, is preserved under the Bohmian flow. Taking this as a measure of typicality, what is typical today will be typical tomorrow. The fact that typical configurations are psi square distributed is called the quantum equilibrium hypothesis.